All right, so in this quick video, I'm gonna show you how you can make, record, and log phone calls with a single click inside of Follow Up Boss. And so right away, I just wanna be right up front. This new feature is designed for teams who are using ISAs for high volume lead follow up and for agents who are making 10 or more calls per day to their new leads, to nurture existing leads, or to call and follow up with their past clients. And what this feature is not designed for is for calling large lists of cold prospects like for sale by owners and expired listings. You should still use a more robust dialer like Mojo or something like that, which we're integrated with uh, for that type of calling. And so what you're looking at here is your follow-up boss dashboard. And so what I've done is I've actually created a smart list that shows me all the leads that have come in recently that I have yet to communicate with, right? So I have not exchanged an email, a call, or a text message with, right? So as you can see, there's only one person in my, uh, my list right now that I need to call. So I'll just click on that person. You can review information about you know, the property that they inquired about, uh, where it came from. You can actually click a link to go and see that over on uh, you know, the site that the lead came from. And then when you're ready to make the phone call, you just click on their phone number. So what you'll see here is um, you know, where you know, the call's been initiated. You can actually mute your side of the call so they wouldn't be able to hear what you're saying on your side. Um, and if you run into a situation where you're working with uh, extensions or you know, automated phone systems, uh, you can go ahead and enter your extension here. Then once you're finished with the call, just hang up. And you'll see that automatically the phone call logs with call time, the number that was used for the phone call, and, uh, and also a place to record any notes. Now, while you're on the call, you can make notes from your call right here at the top. And then when you hit the log call button, it's automatically going to add it to that most recent phone call. Then what you can do to continue following up is you can also send them a text message. And you can send them a quick email and also use some templates that you may have created in advance. You'll see that everything that you do shows up and gets logged automatically right here inside the system. To take it a step further, we've also got full scale reporting for your calls. So what you can do here is you can actually see for each of the agents that have the calling feature enabled, how many calls they've made, and that's also number of dials against how many people they actually tried calling. So if they called the same people more than once, you'll see the difference here. You'll see how many times they connected. You'll see the total number of conversations, which we define as calls lasting five minutes or longer. You'll also see the number of inbound calls they received to the number that they're using. And you'll see a, a total talk time. Um, and so you can adjust this for different time frames here, whatever is relevant for what you're trying to dig into with your team. Because all the calling that you're doing is now going to be integrated right into Follow Up Boss, you also have some additional features from the dashboard that you can access so that you can further filter your contacts. So a few of those options are what I've enabled here, which is last call. You've also got the last call attempted, uh, last call received from that person, the total number of calls made to that particular contact, the total number of calls received from that contact, first call time, which shows you how long it took you from that lead being created to their the first phone call you made in the system. Great for you know evaluating your team and making sure that you're getting those calls out as quickly as possible. And then you can also filter by total talk time, which is a really good indicator. You know, you could show all your contacts that you have spoken to less than five minutes in total, uh, which is indicative that you haven't actually been able to reach them or, or have a real meaningful conversation with them yet. So that's the calling feature in a nutshell. Um, you're able to enable this feature for individual contacts. So for example, if you have 10 agents on your team, but only two of them are working as ISAs or doing really high volume follow-up, you have the option to only enable this call feature um, on their particular account. If you have any questions about how this works, feel free to reach out. We're more than happy to help.